So uh, yeah, welcome to another episode of The Science Behind. Uh, this time I'll be explaining how a saxophone works because I bought one of these about a month ago. So uh, yeah, let's get into it. So you can tell that I'm obviously still in the process of learning, considering that squeak there. I've only had it for about a month. But uh, anyway, let's get into explaining how it works. So most of the noise you hear from a saxophone is actually within this mouthpiece here and within your mouth itself. But uh, we're focusing just on the saxophone for this video. So we've got here three main parts for the mouthpiece. And this is the, the main part. This is what you call the reed. And uh, this sits up against the mouthpiece just like that and when you blow the air um, in there the reed actually vibrates uh, creating resonance inside the main body of the saxophone here and so basically the smaller the saxophone the higher frequency of noise will be produced and the bigger the saxophone the lower frequency of noise will be produced and so to give just a quick demonstration of the reed vibrating against the mouthpiece I've just got the mouthpiece here and of course without the clamp but uh be warned, this sound is, with just the mouthpiece, is not very pleasant. I won't make you listen to that for too long, but that there was sound just produced from the reed vibrating against the mouthpiece there, from the air that I was blowing into it. And then to show that, obviously, the greater the space within the saxophone, uh, the lower the sound, I've just added the neck to it here. So this has, um, rather than this being the space that the air resonates in, I've now got all of this being the space that the air resonates in. So it's a lot greater and you'll hear a lower frequency sound. And so as you heard there, that sound was uh, much lower and a little more pleasant to hear, obviously. But now, adding the rest of the saxophone to it. You could hear that sound was even lower. That was without pressing any of the keys here. And uh, well that's pretty much it, that's how a saxophone works. Obviously the keys, like pushing down those, um, can change the resonance of the uh, sound waves in there, uh, adjusting the note obviously. But yeah, that is another episode done of the science behind uh, this one being how the saxophone works. So I certainly hope you did enjoy that video. For anyone interested, this is a Yamaha Yas 280 saxophone. Um, so it's a beginner's one, uh, great to start on if you're looking to get into saxophone. But yeah, that is now the end of the video. If you do think I've earned it, then please consider subscribing. But until then, I'll see you next time. Bye.